joining me. Thank you for hanging out and coming to see Vlogmas Day 4. Happy Sunday. I hope you're having an incredibly blessed day. And um, this today's going to be short and sweet. I've been out all day. Um, I had my temple visit today in Ogden, Utah. It's about two and a half hours away from me. Um, I left at about 6.30 this morning, and I just got back about 6.30, 6-ish six this evening. I don't know, it was like 6.15 or something, so like a good 12-hour day. <laughs> but it was beautiful. I had a great time, and um, it was wonderful. But I'm beat, so this is going to be not a super long. We're just going to do the advent calendars, and um, I think that's going to be it. I was going to decorate, but I am too tired. So um, I won't be filming tomorrow, so I'll have to do it. I already got Monday's video filmed, so I'll decorate Monday. Or, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Let's start out with our crystal advent calendar. Uh, day four. Day four is right here, this little square. Let's see what we got. Ooh, one of my favorites. See in there? I definitely know what this one is. It is one of my favorite crystals. If I can pull it out. Oh my goodness. Let me just get the box. No? Still no? Come on, you. Get on over there. Twenty years later. Oh, there we go. It came out. This is Tiger Eye. You can see it. There we go. Nice piece of Tiger's Eye. And Tiger's Eye helps states of balance, helps to enhance both confidence and strength, which is lovely. So that is my Tiger Eye. We shall put it in the bag and I'll eventually put it in my stash of, I already have a lot of Tiger's Eye, but it was the first crystal that I loved as a child. Um, my grandpa got me a piece when we first moved to Arizona, and it was the first crystal, mineral, whatever you want to call it, that um, I fell in love with as a child. So there is that, and oh, the... Uh, it was like, what are we doing? The mindfulness. <laughs> Clearly I need some more. Let's get into the mindfulness calendar. 4th of December is listening. Choose consciously to listen to understand when you are in a conversation with a loved one. Let go of any distractions and pay full attention. Use all of your senses, sight, touch, feelings, as well as hearing. What do you notice when you pay attention in this way? That's a really good one. It's actually, I have a little list that I keep on my desk of things that I 
try to remember every day. Um, they are be more forgiving, listen without distraction, be less judgmental, send love to all, and don't let anger guide me. And I keep those on my desk, on my workstation, so I can look at them every day and remind myself to do those things. But listening, especially what I call active listening, where you are engaged with the person, you're not looking at your phone or reading a book or watching television, but you actually look at the person in their eyes and listen and give them, you know, feedback. It's such a lovely way of showing somebody that you care about them. It can actually just transform your relationships completely. So I highly re recommend doing it. Before I ramble on and on about listening, um, and again, I'll put it up here so that you can read it also, uh, screenshot it if you want, and um, I will put the link in the description, which I need to do with all of them. Uh, let me see. Now we're going to go do the door advent calendar. Okay, here we are. And we're on day four. I didn't bring my tripod, so I'm just having to hold it very awkwardly. I'll put it up on the screen for you. Why art thou cast down, O my soul, and why art thou disquieted within me? Hope thou in God, for I shall yet praise him, who is the health of my countenance and my God, which is Psalm 42, 11. Put that back in there. I just kind of leave it like poking out a little bit higher. So I know I already read those ones, although I already know because of the date. And then we'll stick our star in there. Tomorrow is the 5th, which is Monday. And um, I should get my printer ink on that day, on Monday, so I can print out the rest of these guys. So that is that. Oh, sorry. <laughs> darkness. There we go. All right, our last scripture. I think yesterday was Joshua 1. Or Joshua 2. Today's is Ruth 1 through 4. And the little scripture in this one is, Call upon me in the day of trouble, I shall rescue you, and you will honor me. And that's Psalms 50, 15. Very fitting. Very fitting for my day. I have to say... So let me know in the um, description box, are you following along? Are you um, reading or are you just ignoring that part? <laughs> it's good either way. I'm all good. Um, looks like I'm about 10 minutes. So I'll go ahead. I just picked this. I just got this in the mail. Um, this is the temp drop. Um, it's for... Um, basal body temperature. It's like a little band that you wear on your arm at night. Like goes up here. And um, it's supposed to record your most accurate, the most accurate temperature. And they gave me a little oh, it's just a, they gave me a little code that I'll put in the description and you get um, it's like a friend code and you'll get like a little bit off 
of one if you want to try it yourself. Um, I've heard good things about it, and it's not supposed to emit any kind of radiation. So that was one of the things that um, made me want to try it. Come in a nice packaging and a little. Um, there's the product itself comes in like a little satiny kind of stuff so that's what it looks like not too big and then there's supposed to be a band in here as well it's underneath and another pretty looks with the instructions. Ah, I'm losing everything. Mm -hmm. Not sure what this is for. Guess I'll have to look at it. There's the, there's how it's worn. And you put it on before bed. doesn't show in the instructions what this thing is for. <laughs> uh, so I have no idea what this thing is. Maybe it's, I think there's a battery in it that you can change. Yeah, I think the battery, I think you change the battery. It's not like a rechargeable thing. Pretty sure. So this maybe this pries it open. I don't know. I'll I'll figure it out and I'll let you know. I know you turn it on. There's this little pink little pink button right here. There we go. This is how you turn it on, and there's a green light up here. So that's, yeah, it must be to change. There's probably a button cell battery in here. Um, let's see what the band looks like. It says to try to um, use it with my regular, um, there's what the band looks like. And the little thing fits, you put it in right there. And it has like a bra strap type closure and it comes with an extra piece, which is good because unfortunately my arms are flabby, so. No, it actually, it actually does fit without the extension. I am happily surprised. So yeah, it's supposed to be snug, so it doesn't like, because you want it to stay in one position all night. But you're supposed to um, keep using your regular temperature um, thermometer or however you're doing it at the time and um, keep using that so you can verify that it's registering correctly. Um, I got it on a Black Friday deal and I think I think it was, I want to say, I saved $20 on it. It's normally, no, more than that because I, I paid $150, I think, or $170, and it's normally $199. However much that is, I saved that much. <laughs> But yeah, I it was on a on a deal, and the I think the link that they gave me, it's um, I think twenty percent off. So you get to save a little money if you want to give this a try. It's about the same price for all of the temperature type doodads that I've seen, 
and for the convenience it's worth it because you don't have to wake up every single morning at the same time which right now I have to wake up at 4 30 even on my days off because that's the time you should always take your temperature basal body temperature at the same time every day so that you know your pattern and um, you know remembering to wake up at 4 30 every day is kind of a pain and plus I think it's supposed to work even if you get up like in the middle of the night um, and you don't have to like do anything special it, it just keeps track of everything so I will let you know how it goes um, I'll probably put it on tonight and start tracking it but um, yeah we're almost 20 minutes in and I still have to post this tonight so I'm getting sleepy I still need to take a shower and um, yeah so happy Sunday happy vlogmas day four um, peace out thank you so much for joining me and remember the world is full of amazing wonderful kind beautiful loving awesome people and if you're not able to find one then you can 100% be one bye I had to come back and show you the process of putting this thing in here it's like trying to give birth I swear like we're trying to put this thing into this little hole and it says to push it up and then pull the sides from the instructions let me stand up and do try this Got it. <gasps> I did it. Yay, in only two minutes. All right, bye again.